Hey everybody, welcome to Comic Book Club. I'm Justin. I am Pete. And we are here at uh, Rocket Ship. Rocket Ship uh, in Brooklyn. Great comic book store in, on Smith Street in Brooklyn, yep. which is where we live, sort of. Yeah, and, well it's uh, closer to you. Yeah, but it's cool. So this is just a little peek behind the curtain of Comic Book Club. <laughs> A um, couple shout-outs real quick. Uh, yeah. Shout-out to MyCast Networks. They're uh, posting our show now. Hey, so thanks. Yeah, Appreciate thank that. Uh, Shout-out to John Amore over in the Philippines. Yeah, John. Uh, He's an amazing artist. Great artist. Um, getting some stuff together for us. Um, and let's get right into the comics. Well, we should say uh, Alvin, uh, Zalvin. Not What's Alvin. his name? I don't remember. Yeah, it's not uh, Alex and Zalvin is Alvin. Yeah. Uh, still watching the so-called baby of his yeah. that he still had. Seen it. Uh, so. Spoiler, it's going to grow up. I don't know. <laughs> deal. Uh, let's move into the comics. Uh, we yes. have Invincible Iron Man number 22. Good Lord. This is a great book. Uh, it, it's phenomenal. We voted it one of the best of last year. The number one. Uh, picking right up where it left off. Yeah. Uh, still, spoiler, uh, we don't know if he's going to make it out. Yeah. I don't know. Uh, here, he I think could he be is. dead. I, I don't know. I think this Tony is the Stark. end of the title. Probably going to, Iron it's Man 2 over. coming out, I think he's going to pull through. No, I don't think so. I think it's Hollywood's going to make him pull through. I don't, I don't Special think Hollywood vaccine. has anything to do with uh, comics. No, great doctors. Um, i got to say... Fraction has a way of distilling the entire uh, Siege event, the whole, everything that's going on in the Marvel Universe right in this comic in a way that makes it much more reader-friendly, uh, it's smarter, yeah. it's subtle moves. You see Doctor Strange back in his Amazing old gear. Amazing colors and Doctor, Doctor Strange, Strange looks at his clothes, he's like, remember this? Yeah. But he doesn't even need to say it, because it's right in his face. It's, it's a great move. Yeah, it's phenomenal, it's fantastic, there's a lot of drama in it, I highly recommend it. If you're not reading this comic, you are literally insane. <laughs> uh, let's move on to Adventure Comics, number six. Um, hey, uh, here we have... Sadly, the end of the Jeff Johns uh, run on this. Which... I don't think he's got anything left to do now for DC. I think that's <laughs> it. He's going to retire because there's nothing left for him to do. I, he's not working on if, anything. If he retires, comics may end. <laughs> There'll be a surplus of staples. It's going to be terrible. Uh, this was actually uh, really good. You liked it. This is the first one I liked out of all of them. And uh, really did an amazing job with Lex, Lex Luthor and Superboy. Because Superboy's been kind of going back and forth on who he should fight for and what side he's on. And he's been journaling, which yeah. is odd. It's great. Actually, he wrote to journal more often. No. Um, this story's fantastic. Lex Luthor, uh, the way Jeff Johns wrote it, it's a great portrayal Classic of a villain. Classic Luthor. Acting like Classic. a villain. Classic. And without any violence. It's just like, villain, perfect. Evil. I mean, there's a little violence. Uh, just a touch. Uh, but it's sad to see this run end so early, um, especially when I feel like they were setting up so much. A lot of great stuff, yeah. It was amazing. And will the we, art's phenomenal. Will we ever hear from this young John's upstart again? I, hope I don't so. know. I hope Tune so. in next year. Then we've got a little bit of a, uh, a Batman check in, uh, sort of. Uh, yeah. Batgirl number six and Batman number 695. Um, of course, Bruce Wayne is still lost to time. Yeah, or yeah, or in a cave somewhere drawing many bat symbols. Uh, rumor has it he's going to be a pirate at one point. Uh, stay tuned for that. <laughs> um, i got to say, it's interesting because I found the Batman comic uh, to be sort of bad, while Batgirl, which features Batman and Robin, to be awesome. Yeah, I... Why is the essential Batman in Batgirl? Huh. Interesting. Think about that. Think about that a little bit, but I have to disagree with you a little bit. Batman, there's a lot of adventure in this, a lot of action. Adventure. Which, which is fun. Uh, yeah, it's just non-stop one thing after another. I which think sometimes, it's too much. Yeah, but sometimes it's all it's over the place. The there's comic. like, the villains of the Falcone family, like, uh, and Huntress is there. Huntress is everywhere right now. Yeah, she she's more popular more. than Batman. I don't know about that. Um, she dr Batgirl, on the other hand, great character work. It's uh, it's a nice to see Batgirl and Robin fighting. Uh, yeah, that was kind of there's some fun Oracle stuff in here. Get to your separate quarters. Yeah, yeah. yeah. After very a timeout, it was funny. It was very funny. So I say definitely pick up Batgirl. Pass on pass on old Batman. Well, I don't know about that, but uh, I'd say check them out. They're both very good. Uh, and also, so uh, we're gonna I'm gonna be out in L.A. and San Francisco for the next couple weeks. So if you yes. guys if anyone's out there, no, it's not a vacation for you, Pete. Oh. If you guys are out there, I'm going to need someone to sit in with me to review some comics. So Because he's bringing the camera with him. I'm bringing right. the camera with me to review some comics on the road. Um, if you're in the L.A. and San Francisco area, hit us up on Twitter at Comic Book Live, and uh, we will, I will meet you and review comics with you. Oh, wow, nice little outreach program you're doing. Yeah, well, I'm going to be uh, doing a little tour. You're dropping so. all the dead weight and doing your own show? Finally, finally. Which uh, brings me to my next point real quickly. That means the live show for two weeks is just me. Just Come Pete. on down yeah. to the pit. It's going to be amazing. Completely new yeah. comic book show. We're calling it Comic Book Trainwreck. Uh, sort of <laughs> that's not what we're title. calling it at all. <laughs> oh, sorry, that's just a sort of private thing. Uh, but thanks for coming out. If you're ever in Brooklyn, um, come to Rocket Ship. It's a great comic book store. And thank you, folks.